Have you ever noticed something strange floating in the sky above Whiterun? Over the years I've heard of many sightings of strange clouds appearing in the sky outside Whiterun. Maybe you've seen them too. What are these strange clouds that appear over Whiterun? Right from the beginning of the game as the player leaves Helgen and heads towards Whiterun, in the distance are strange cloud-like shapes that appear in the sky, slowly alternating and fading in and out of existence. I've seen many players hypothesize on their origins, and up until recently, I was under the impression that they were in fact, Hermaeus Mora, the Daedric Prince of Knowledge and Memory. The resemblance is striking, right? I set out to discover the truth behind these strange clouds, once and for all, and the truth is very interesting. The exact location of these clouds is above the giant's camp, called Blackwind Basin, and a solitary cloud just off to the left of the camp. If we toggle free camera and fly right up to these clouds, we can see that they are in fact not Hermaeus Mora, but rather dust or debris. Exactly the kind you find inside almost every cave in Skyrim used for environmental and atmospheric world building. So why are they here and what's causing them? I jumped into the creation kit to explore further, although after examining this area, I could not seem to locate the source of these clouds. The only item in the sky is this X marker, used in the game's scripting for various situations. I'm unaware why this marker is even here, as it seems to be directly linked to a Radiant Quest scenario over in Falkreath. Strange. So although I was able to identify these clouds, I'm still unable to locate their source. However, I did discover that if the player has the unofficial Skyrim patch installed, these clouds disappear. So with this discovery, I believe I can say with relative certainty that these mysterious clouds are nothing more than yet another bug, uh, sorry, feature, left in the game by Bethesda. To my knowledge, these clouds only appear in a new game, and if the player loads a save, or restarts the game, they disappear. This might explain how and why Bethesda missed them when testing the game. However, one question still remains, what exactly is triggering them? That part of the mystery remains unsolved. Do you have more insight into this mystery? Have you seen these clouds in your game? What other Skyrim mysteries do you know of? Comment below and let me know. Thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed. And remember to subscribe for more Elder Scrolls content.